up and welcome back to another card mobile video now over here today we're gonna go ahead and look at the brand new update that came out a few hours ago it brought in some new free epic rewards some new challenges and just some more rewards in general as well as two new bundles and a brand new feature for ranked that's pretty cool in my opinion so anyway guys i cannot wait to go ahead and show you guys all the new stuff but one more thing, my giveaway is coming to an end in just one day and all of the steps are at the beginning of the video. So anyway guys, I hope all of you are hyped for that. But anyways, let's go ahead and hop into this video. So let's go ahead and check out the brand new events. Firstly, if we go to daily, we do have some brand new daily login rewards. And I think this is super, super cool. The final frontier daily login rewards. So firstly guys, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the best rewards of it. So firstly, after four days, you are going to go ahead and get a spray and it looks pretty nice guys it does have like the whole bull there of the horns and it does say once it's not bad at all if we go down some more there's going to be a sand duins knife it's going to be green rarity but still it's going to be a free knife skin over there and then after six days you're going to go ahead and get an epic wild west frame and that over there is extremely cool personally i like getting frames and this one over here is absolutely free that's very very good news there so now the best reward in my opinion is going to be after seven days and that's going to be the blue rare dlq 33 bandit now personally i love like this lightish red with the darkish gray and i think it looks so damn good together kind of reminds me of the red action skins but a little bit different and i really like the way the bandit skins do go ahead and look so overall guys i'm so so excited for this one over here but that's not going to be all if we go on and we go to the featured stuff over here we have a brand new challenge and it's going to be the one last farewell now over here there's two epic rewards plus two rare rewards to go ahead and get and to be honest i am actually a fan of most of the rewards except the very first one the dead or alive spray i just think it's a little bit messy you have the guns you have the boot and you have the wanted all together on one thing it's just a kind of messy in my opinion but i do like the maverick spray that over there is super super cool i like the wanted sign plus the hat i think it looks nice and then we have another epic frame the revolver frame this over here guys is super cool it's very classy it has like the gold and the red and the black goes together super super nicely and very very cool over there and then the final reward the best one by the way the knife moonstone now, as you guys know i love the moonstone skin so having a knife with the moonstone skin is going to be super super cool in my opinion and i do have enough points to go ahead and get the knife right down i'm so excited so here we go guys 92 points and there she is the knife moonstone super cool guys like i said i love the moonstone skin so the more guns and you know items i can have that moonstone skin on I'm just going to be so, so happy over there. So overall, guys, I would definitely go ahead and say, guys, this is really, really worth it. It's pretty easy to go ahead and do. All you have to do is basically to complete a couple of challenges. And to be honest, they're fairly easy. So basically, all you have to do is go play five MP matches with friends, play three CTF matches, play 10 CTF matches, play five CTF matches on Rust. Now, that over there took me a super long time because I barely ever got the map Rust. So, I had to go ahead and play a lot of CTF matches to finally go ahead and get Rust. But, all you can go ahead and do is just skip that and go ahead and play 5 MP matches with French, which is very, very quickly over there. And then go ahead and kill 30 enemies in CTF matches. And then also go ahead and stay online for a total of 60 minutes to go ahead and get some more points. And then finally, send some EXP cards to friends. Also, play a couple of 1v1 matches and also... Just play a couple of ranked matches as well. So overall, guys, I think it's pretty much worth it. It's very, very cool. And also, two epic rewards plus two rare rewards. And ultimately, that knife, I think, is very, very worth it. It does look super, super cool in my opinion. And then before we go ahead and check out the new bundles, if you go to more, we have this new feature over here, Solo Shield. And basically what this is, guys, you are going to be protected from losing rank points in both multiplayer and battle royale when you do go ahead and play a match and lose. And it does seem like you have five chances for both multiplayer and battle royale every single day. And, you know, once it's done, it goes back to losing points if you go ahead and lose a game. And I did go ahead and test this out, guys. I lost the match in multiplayer and I didn't lose any rank points whatsoever. And as you guys can see, I do still have two more chances for today in multiplayer and five more in battle royale and i'm pretty sure every single day it is going to go ahead and reset and the next day you are going to have five more chances for both multiplayer and for battle royale 
And I think that is super, super cool and extremely helpful as well. But anyways, now moving on to the brand new bundles. We have two new bundles, the Mr. Fixer 2 bundle as well as the Space Race bundle. Now let's go ahead and start with the Mr. Fixer bundle. Over here, we have a couple of blue skins as well as one green rarity skin. Now the blue skins, the steel cuts look super cool. I like the way they look. But I don't think this bundle over here is really worth it because guys, the guns in there aren't really guns that I personally go ahead and use. But the Space Race Bundle is super nice. We have the Firebreak Panda over here. That's a super cool skin. We have the Firebreak Headgear, the body, and also the backpack, as well as a UL736 Meteor Showers, and also a Knife Skin, as well as a Meteor's Frame. Now, it's super cool, but I am not going to go ahead and buy it, because I already own, like, everything in this crate, except the frame and the clothes. Like, I own Firebreak Panda, and I think he's super cool. I own the UL736, and I'm pretty sure I own the Knife as well. I just don't own the frame and the headgear and the clothes and the backpack but i don't actually like that i like the base skin of firebreak panda i don't like the whole suit of firebreak panda so overall i am not going to go ahead and pick up the space race bundle just because i have most of the items and the items i don't have i am not the biggest fan of but anyway guys it is an awesome bundle and if you do not have it i would say it's a pretty good one to go ahead and get because you get the normal character but you also get a bunch of accessories as well as a knife skin a frame and a cool looking gun as well now overall guys that is the brand new update, a bunch of free epics as well as two new bundles and no lucky draw or no crit. So overall guys, I think it was an awesome update, a bunch of brand new cool stuff in the game. So overall guys, that is going to be the whole video and I really hope you guys to go ahead and enjoy it. And also, please let me know what you guys think of all the new stuff in the game. Do you like it? or not and also are you gonna go ahead and pick up the new bundles as well as are you gonna go ahead and grind for the new epic rewards as well so anyway guys i hope all of you have a great day and i hope all of you enjoy the brand new update as well so anyways squally out if you can stay and cheers bye